What's up, sneaker fam? It's your boy, Mick Fly, the hardest working man in shoe tainment today. Coming at you again with another real review, man. If this is your first time over here in the land of McFly, Fly, welcome you. I appreciate you stopping by. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, man. Hit that notification bell to keep you up to date with everything that I got going on. We're currently on the road to 5K, trying to get that done by the end of the year, man. So everybody sub up, man. We will be good to go. Also, subscribe to the Who Has the Heat YouTube channel, man. That's where we premiere all the greatest sneaker battles ever seen on YouTube. YouTube, man. So if you ever miss one, go check them out. Uh, Tournament of Champions coming up real soon. Tournament of Champions 2, I mean, coming up real soon. Um, we've also got, uh, we wrapped up the Jersey Kicks battle. We wrapped up the LeBron only battle, which was epic. And we also wrapped up season eight, which was epic as well, man. Just three bangers for this year, man. We have totally ran sneaker battles this year, every year, really. But if they did sneaker awards, we would definitely <laughs> definitely get the award this year man so today man we got the towelies on deck man the classic 80s y'all already know man just a shell toe without shell toe you dig if you know you know if you don't know i just told you um if you're a fan of south park this is right up your alley you know adidas has been doing a lot with the simpsons um south park branching off to other little tv shows and stuff like that man really trying to step out and um I'll do a little bit more and I commend them for it. Um, I actually didn't hit this pair on my own. My nephew had exclusive access and he gave up the access to give this pair to me. So I greatly appreciate him. Shout out to you, bro. I still am a little bit of shock that you did that, but I ended up hitting um, K and Purple Fours for him. So he owed me something. Like right? that's three K and Purple Fours is far more magnificent. <laughs> didn't eat, so we're gonna have to come to another conclusion. Something, something, you know, it's all good, man. It's family, favor for a favor. You did, it's what we do over here, man. Anything for the team to hit for retail. But, um, the shoe is crazy, man. Um, Tao Lee and Mr. Hanky were actually two of my favorite, um, characters from, um, South Park. And as you know, Mr. Tao Lee is a Tao and he's high the majority of the time. Um, Adidas did real good with the branding. You have uh, the South Park logo on the heel. You also have the boys and stuff around the sides. The paper's branded with the boys on it as well. And um, just to get into this shoe, it's pretty simple. It's not much to it. You got that all white sole and midsole. Wrap around. Classic with your traction. Hair and bone traction. You know pretty simple on your base you also have your white three stripes on your uh, medial side as well as your white three stripes on your lateral side wrapping around to the back you have the adidas branding here bam 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 y'all see it uh the shoe actually came with these keychains i'll put one in each shoe so i won't forget to talk about them sober tally as you can see him with his adidas on by the way don't forget to put that out there flip it around to the back the back reads don't forget to bring a towel Adidas South Park. That's also on the tongue, on the back of the tongue of the shoe as well. Then you have another one, keychain, a stoned towel. See? Out of his mind. Look at that. He is gone. Flip it over to the back, and this one says, uh, I have no idea what's going on. And of course, he don't have no idea what's going on. South Park and Adidas brand. Two keychains, very sturdy, very heavy. Shout out to them for that. Now to start the show, you see this big, thick, towel-esque, I mean, you could probably wash with it. It's like legit, all towel on the upper, thick blue. See it, just like your bath towel, or whatever towel you use, whatever you use towels for. I mean, you know, I don't know what's going on in your household. Uh, you got yellow tips on the laces, yellow tip that lace as well then you also have the flat blue laces in the joint i am going to find me some white fat laces and i am going to put those in here we're going straight up old school with these i'm putting the fattest of laces that i can find the star of the show is the towerly eyes on top they also transition um they get red and blue across the top the high eyes just like um on that keychain in the sunlight, the eyes will turn to these eyes. Step outside to get y'all some of that color change action. On these towelies. You're over here in the sun. 
as you can see, oh boy, it's baked right now, ain't it? Baked, baked. All the way baked. But for some reason, the right shoe get darker than the left shoe. So I'm wondering if like over time, they just won't change at all. I ain't 100% sure, but let's see if I expose them both a little more, see what happens. stone though you also got his eyebrows stitched in up here eyes flip around to the inside you have that blue towel with the south park and adidas branding on the inside there on the other shoe had a couple tags on it and i'll show the tags for all the tag people i think these were like 100 or 110 retail i don't think resale is pretty high on the shoe's fairly old it dropped like over a year ago and um Adidas just had like a random restock or whatever. So, excuse me, shout out to the random restock. Same eyes on this joint. Interior, heel, also pretty much all the same. As standard as you could possibly get. I can hunt me down a pair of all those black and white Run DMC shell toes. And I'll be good to go with like my throwback Adidas model. That's all I really need. And the cut. Boom. See it? Shoot. Beautiful. Right? All right then. So, uh, sizing. You definitely gonna want to go true to size on these. No need to size up or size down. True to size is just fine. Worked out for me. Um, you can actually go to the mall and try on these. They're readily available. Not this particular shoe, but the model. You can find them anywhere so go to your local wherever and just try them on if you, you know doubt what i'm saying it is what it is um comfort's all right it's just like a jordan one or chuck taylor or any of those older models with the flat soles if you got high arches or something in your feet you may not really like these but for all us flat-footed folks straight up my alley 100 percent no problem i'm definitely gonna wear these and um it's, it's gonna be a good time anytime <laughs> anytime that i do wear them happy to have them um i don't want to dirty up my outsole and midsole yet so i'm not gonna own for these but um yeah it's what it is bro gave y'all the information you needed all that good stuff shout out to nephew for the alley shout out to y'all for coming through and watching keeping up with your boy keeping track of all the things that i got going on man and until next time it's your boy mcfly and these stoner shoes i'll holler at you